So, the last time that we were here at the Poly, I found and met the woman who I'm going to marry, and who's going to adopt Angelina. Uh, what? <laughs> um, the woman I'm going to marry, at least. There was a, a immediate attraction like between the both of us, so much so that she offered to come over and take our picture in front of the tiki down there. Did she not do that? Did she not do that? She did that. Right. So there was an immediate like attraction, one of the signs that you can just feel it. Um, and I said that when I came back this time, uh, I was possibly going to propose, uh, even if not propose, just let her know that we will be back here in June. Uh, and then I'll have a surprise for her at that point, and then maybe in June I'll propose. Maybe I'll just take her out on a date this time. Because again, you know, when the attraction is like that, you only need to go out once before you get married. So, um, so yeah, we're, we're here and I'm looking for her. Um, Angelina says that she saw her. I'm not sure that I believe her. I think she's just trying to tease me. No, I did. But once we, once we find her, uh, maybe we'll, uh, we'll talk to her and we'll talk about uh, our future together. And I mean, you know, the, the many things that we're gonna do as we grow old. So I'll let you know once that happens. Disney's Magic Kingdom, kind of, now, friendship boat launch, uh, but look who feels a little better. This girl. Yeah, so that's good. I got my, I got my buddy back, my baby girl back, so now we can go about, so what are we doing this morning? Um, we're heading to our reservation for Kona Cafe. Okay. Those are some nice ears you have there. Mm -hmm. My friend Meg made them for me, and um, she makes really, really nice ears. Um, her Instagram, she's making like a bunch of new pairs. Her Instagram is Dancing Ears Designs, all one word. So you should definitely go check her Instagram out to make some nice ears. Yep, and check them out on YouTube as well. There you are, the the Disney, Disney Gang Disney. underscore YT. Yeah, that's their Instagram. Right, so that's their Instagram, and then you can check them out on YouTube just at the Disney the Gang. Disney so, Gang. check them out. They go on some fun adventures as well. Yeah. But here comes our boat, which is going to take us over to the Polynesian for Kona Cafe breakfast, and then we're going to head over to Animal Kingdom to go on a couple rides here this morning. Gonna hit up Kilimanjaro and Everest. Everest. And then later on tonight we will be back at the Magic Kingdom. You can kinda of see back there, but not really. Oh, I think I can see the sign up there. Yes, the Magic Kingdom. Going to the Magic Kingdom. Yeah, that's not the song for here, but... Ohana's up there, we'll be eating breakfast up there at Ohana tomorrow, but this morning it is Kona. We can't wait to stay here in June. I'm so excited. Like, we can't wait. It's gonna be awesome. Good times. I can't wait to go to Trader Sam's Grob Grotto, stuff like that. Stuff like that that we could do now, but yeah, you know, I mean, it's not like we're staying here. Gotta go out of my way to 
take my kid to a bar, and I'm just not that guy, so. So we'll wait until we stay here. And one night we'll stop in there before we go to the parks or something like that, but such a beautiful resort area here. As I say every time we're here, so. Look at all these people bowing to the god of Tiki. Look at this man, he's just bowing to him. Welcome to Squidward's Tiki Land. Tiki, Tiki, ooh ah, Tiki, Tiki. All right, so we're here at Kona, where the sun is coming through the roof there and just about blasting our table here. And thank you very much. And Angelina got her fruit, her enormous fruit, side of sausage. And for once, I didn't get the Tonga toast. I'm trying the big kahuna. Just eggs, pancakes, French toast, sausage, ham, bacon, home fries. I'm gonna be full. That's what I know. And it's gonna be good. So, yeah, so let's have at it. Breakfast, day four. Breakfast time. So, how was your breakfast? Very good. Yeah? Are you full now? Filled up with your fruit plate, banana bread and stuff. And yeah, mine was, was very good too, as you can see. I only left half a piece of French toast. There's just enough bread with the pancakes and the toast there. But I gobbled down all that protein. Good stuff. And they have great coffee here too. Kona coffee is excellent. So we're going to head out of here shortly and catch the bus to Animal Kingdom. Go on, Kilimanjaro is our first fast pass there. And we'll see what else we can get into today. All right, so here we are at Animal Kingdom. We just got off the bus. Construction update. That is the floating something or other of Avatar, which is gonna be Avatar Land, which I'm sure, I mean, there's like floating rocks everywhere. Um, I'll be excited to go on this stuff like when it comes open, but I mean Avatar is not like a property that I'm that excited about to begin with. It looks kind of cool for what it is and hopefully the rides and stuff will be really cool once it's open, but we shall see in the words of Snow. We shall see. Welcome to Disney's Animal Kingdom. The hottest amusement park in all the land. Dinosaurs alive and well. You you can find them here at Disney's Animal Kingdom. Thank you, thank you, Stacy. Stacy's going to tell you all of the must dos that you must do to do do uh, that you have to do do on your trip to avoid making a do do. The do do. So we are going to go straight to Kilimanjaro because we have a fast pass that expires there in about 30 minutes and we don't want to miss it. And I think Kilimanjaro is like one of our favorite things here. I'll stop and take a look at this waterfall first because it is pretty beautiful. And there's some macaws over there we'll look at as well. But look at that. There's some duck bathing going on. Put your trunks on, buddy. We're in public. Isn't it majestic? It's the Tree of Life. Do they still have the projection show on there at night? We haven't seen that yet. I don't know that we're going to get a chance to this trip. Um, probably not. Would you like to become a wilderness explorer? 
Yes. Hello. <laughs> it's tough to be a wilderness explorer. Wait, I don't think that's how it goes. It's tough to be a bug. I hate bugs. Yes. Even after seeing that show so many times, Angelina still doesn't appreciate what bugs do. Nope. So she's going to have to go back on that ride today. I wonder if we'll see Tina Fey here today. If so, we're finally going to get that reaction from her.